In this short video, we are going to reset EX3700 gear range extender device. It's simpler than you think. Locate the factory reset on your neck gear extender on the side or back of your extender. Take a small pin and press in that hole and you will notice that the LED lights on the extender begin to change. The extender will power off and it can take a few minutes to boot up again. Now it's time to go to your computer or laptop screen and what you will notice is that the extender has been disconnected as after the factory reset you had to set up the Netgear extender again. Go to my Wi-Fi X.net if on Windows device or my Wi-Fi X.local if on Apple device. In case using an Android device go to 92.168.1.250. A screen appears in front of you and now click on the new extender setup that leads you to a new page, where you will need to create a new account in order to install your extender and this page is called the Netgear Genie Smart Wizard. Now fill in all the necessary details such as a valid email address, password and once you are done click on the next button. Now you had two choices as you can either set up your range extender device as a range extender or as an access point. We are going to click on the range extender and then it will scan for the available networks and give you a list of all the networks available. Before heading ahead into the video in case you are facing any issue with your Netgear range extender device, get in touch with our Netgear experts. Click on the network that you wish to extend. In my case, it's Netgear router, and then it would ask you for the password of your network and all you will need to do is fill in the password of your existing network. And click on the next. In case if the Wi-Fi password that you just typed in is correct then your extender will establish a connection between your extender and router. It also allows you to use a different password or use the same password or none at all. If you choose none at all then anyone will be able to connect with your Netgear extender. I am going to choose a new password. My Wi-Fi extender name is, Paul's, you can choose any you like. Now we are successfully done with setting up our Netgear, EX3700, range extender, now go to our taskbar and connect to our newly set up, Paul's, range extender. And open up our browser and Google appeared which means our extended network is working. In case if you are still facing any issue with your Netgear range extender device, get in touch with our Netgear range extender experts for instant solutions. Thanks for watching our video and do not forget to like, share, and comment on the video, so that you never miss any video from our channel.